Hey there, thanks for joining us. Be sure to watch this entire video as we guarantee it will be worth your time. Mark Dwayne here from markdwayne.com and here we are into the members area of DFY Authority. And what DFY Authority is, is it's a way to go out and find expired domains that you can do a, a, a number of different things with. You can buy the domain and resell it, like do what they call domain flipping with. You can buy the domain and do what they call forwarding, where you put your affiliate link in there. You go get an affiliate link from an offer that's relevant because these domains are still active and they're just expired because the owners decided to let them go. And you can put an affiliate link in there because people do still click on these. And if they click on it and they uh, purchase a product, you're going to get a commission. So that's one way to make money with it. And what I do is I do the forwarding, then put it on um, GoDaddy's premium listing until it sells. And just have it forward to the uh, affiliate offer until it sells on GoDaddy. Um, what this is actually more designed for is so that you can find high authority domains. That's why it's called authority. And the done for you is, is it goes out and searches them by it on its own. So you don't have to go out and search them. So anyway, what, what the, that means is you make private blog networks with them. And what private blog networks are, are PBNs is there a series of websites all connected to de together with high authority backlinks connected to them. And then you connect them to your homepage, which gives you instant authority to your homepage, which looks good in Google's eyes. So you get higher rankings. So you have these high quality backlinks pointing to your domain, which will give you higher rankings. That's what's uh, what this is really designed for, but you can use a number of different things for these uh, domains, but it will find the domains and you can go out and purchase them. You can hook them all together so that they point to your website. And that's what this uh, program is really designed for. Um, you can um, use it the other way if you want. That's what I do with them. But anyway, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to play a demo by Joshua Zamora, the uh, the owner of the product. It's an overview that he made. It's about nine minutes long. And then I'm going to come back and we're going to go through some of these tabs here. So I'm going to play that demo video now and then I'll be back. Hey guys, Joshua Zamora here with just a quick tutorial video to show you how Done For You Authority works. Uh, so pretty much once you log in, you're going to see an overview of what Done For You Authority has done over the last seven days. Uh, as you can see over here, it has found over 10,000 domains over the last seven days alone. Okay, uh, And to take a look at what we have found, you come over here to the domains tab. And this is pretty much where the magic happens, okay? Uh, to You can customize this how, however much you want. Uh, you can come up here and uh, remove some of these, uh, add some of these, and just pretty much customize it based on the type of uh, metrics that you want to see right away, okay? And then once you see a domain that you particularly like, you can click on this icon here to view all the domain stats, or you can click this icon here to actually reveal that domain. So if I click this option here, you can see that was revealed. And the reason that we built it this way uh, on a credit-based system is pretty much to give everyone a fair shot at finding good quality domains, okay? Because I know that uh, something like Done For You Authority is going to attract a lot of power users, people that understand the power of expired domains. Uh, so we didn't want someone to come in here and just go through all of the uh, domains, looking at them and buying them right away, okay? We wanted to give everyone a fair shot. So uh, that's the reason we built it like that. Uh, so once you uh, reveal the domain, Again, you can click this link here and it was, it's going to give you all the information that you need to know about that domain. Okay, It's going to give you the general information up here. 
Uh, it's going to give you the mods information here, the majestic information down here, the SEM rush, the hrefs, uh, the social stats, and the wayback machine as well. Okay, um, then you can close that out. Uh, if you want to shortlist this domain, uh, you can click on the star here, and that's going to add it over here to your shortlist, uh, just so you can do some further analysis in uh, the future. So if you're coming in, coming in here and quickly looking through these lists, revealing domains, and then you shortlist them, and then later on you can go through the ones that you actually shortlist a bit further. Okay. If you want to just go ahead and sh purchase this domain right away, you can click this icon right here, and then you're going to be taken to our platform where you can go ahead and purchase that domain right away okay uh, i'm going to go ahead and close that and you can see this one right here you can get it for 8.99 which is pretty inexpensive uh, so i'm going to close that out uh, now if you want to go ahead and add some filters and really filter things out because you can see here we have over 70 73 000 domains in the um database as of right now and it's just going to keep growing by a thousand to three thousand every single day uh, so obviously you do want to have uh, some kind of criteria that you follow to buy good domains and if you don't know what any of this means uh, make sure you check the bonuses tab because we will have uh, two reports that walk you through what all of this means and how to properly analyze domains um, and then we also have another PDF that walks you through the different ways that you can make money with these domains. Uh, and then here we also have the terminologies list, uh, which breaks down uh, pretty much everything that uh, everything, uh, what all of this means. OK, uh, so if I go back to the domains tab, you can come here and add filters. OK, so for example, if you want to find domains with a specific TLD, meaning if they're .com, .net, .org, .info, this is where you do that, okay? And if you are in a different country, okay, you can you find domains in your particular country. So you can see we have Australian domains in here, Canada. Um, I'm not sure what CN is, but we have that in there. Uh, C, uh, CZ, uh, I believe this one is Germany. I believe this one's Spain. Okay, so we have uh, Europe, France, all right, we have a ton of different countries in here. We have a load of Japan domains as well, uh, very high quality Japan uh, domains, Mexico. Okay, so you can go through here and pick the ones that you want, all right, uh, and then you can also filter down by keywords. So if you want to just find uh, domains that have weight in it or weight loss in it, you can do that, click apply. And then only the weight loss domains or the domains that have the word weight loss in it will show up. OK, and you can see 145 domains in here with the word weight loss. So, for example, if I go ahead and reveal this one, 18 weight loss tips, you can see all of these will have the word weight loss in it. So if you want to look for niche specific domains, you can do that. All right. Uh, if you want to look for uh, domains that were found on a specific site, so if I cover wikipedia.org, that's going to return all of the domains that have a backlink from wikipedia.org. And you can also sort uh, these options here as well by lowest and by highest. Uh, but you also don't want to just go based on stats because there are some very valuable domains in here uh, that sometimes may show low stats. OK, or Moz may show low stats and Majestic shows high stats or vice versa. Majestic shows low uh, high stats and Moz shows um, high stats. So uh, you do want to take everything into account uh, because, you know, you want to go dig a, a bit deeper to ensure whether that's a good domain or not. Obviously, if it's posted on Wikipedia, uh, that gives you an advantage from the get go. OK. Uh, so you can see this is a Panama based uh, domain here. And if I click on this option there, it gives me exactly where that domain was found. All right. So you can do that for pretty much anything. You can put any uh, domain here. So if I put CNN.com and click apply, it's going to return all domains that have backlinks from CNN. Okay. So you can literally do this for anything. 
All right, and then down here is where you can take things a bit uh, further and specify the kind of stats that you want. Okay, one thing that I have found to be pretty good is to set the page authority to 15, set this to 15, and then go to Majestic and set the trust flow to 10, Majestic citation flow to 10, and that right there usually gives me uh, some pretty good domains to look at. Uh, just from the start, you can see all of these uh, look like some pretty good stats. But again, this is all subjective. It all is going to come down to what you're looking for. Uh, so if I reveal this domain here, a .NET domain, okay, laysborough.net, obviously you want to be taking a closer look into that um, just to see what it can uh, look like if, it, if it's actually uh a good domain and you can see sometimes uh, even though we found the domain someone might have picked it up so that message there the red one uh, means that that domain in particular is no longer available but no credit would have been taken from you okay so if I go ahead and change this to 50 so you can see 50 domains all right and you can see that as soon as I uh, set those uh, minimums for these uh, different metrics uh, you start to also see that a lot of them have pretty good backlinks. So Wikipedia, Wikipedia there, Wikipedia there. All right, this one found on blogger.com. All right, so just by the fact that you are uh, looking based on these stats, you start to see that it also correlates with where they are found. All right, so um, that's pretty much in a nutshell how you can come in here and use uh, Done For You Authority. All right, and here obviously you can further down uh, even more by social, by the Wayback Machine if you want domains that are specific uh, age. Okay, if you want really old domains, you can use this. If you want domains with specific SEM rush uh, metrics, and these two here are part of our upgrade. So if you didn't purchase our upgrade, make sure you do so. SEM rush will pretty much give you traffic stats uh, and also all this other information as well. And Ahrefs uh, gives you the domain rating, which is one of the more powerful uh, domain stats that you can have. Okay, so uh, that's pretty much done for you, Authority. In a nutshell, you can come in here and really find some great quality domains. And again, every day we are adding between a thousand to three thousand domains every single day. Uh, and one thing here, uh, I'll have an another video to show how you can add uh, domains to your portfolio. Okay, that was the demo video by Joshua Zamora, the owner of the program. And I think he does a very good job in that overview of explaining the concept behind this program, how it works, what the idea of it is. So I'm briefly going to go through these tabs here. Um, anyway, um, we're on the dashboard, and this is the number of URLs it's checked, the domains it's checked, the available domains it's found. This is where you buy credits right here. And here's the domains that it's checked. And it's got the different uh, categories here. Um, you can also uh, view the domain stats. You can add it to a short list if you want to purchase the domain, maybe look at it more. And uh, here's where you can buy the domain. Of course, here's the name of the domain. And here's your short listed domains right here. And here's your portfolio section. And here's the tutorials. And this is the place I recommend that you start. If you're not familiar with PBNs and how they work and all that, I highly recommend that you start here. There is money in this thing. Um, there's also a way that you can boost your rankings for your website on Google if you learn how to use these PBNs. Um, because the high ranking authority websites all linked together, boost the rank of your site. And that looks good in Google's eyes. So anyway, um, here's the support tab. If you have troubles, you'll go here. Here's the vendor bonuses. These are the vendor bonuses. You get those here. And then here's my products. Now, Joshua Zamora hooks his, uh, products all together in their dashboard. So if you've got another Joshua Zamora product, you can actually access it normally 
from the my products those are the different products that you've purchased he, he has a number of different products um and you can um hook them together or he hooks them together so that you can get access to them he's uh big into the search engine optimization space and the social media space well anyway that's the uh brief overview demo of uh done for you authority if it's something that you think you're interested in you can get access to it and my exclusive custom bonuses in a link or button somewhere on this page you just go to my bonus page you purchase the program and you'll get access to all my exclusive custom custom bonuses and if you uh like my videos don't forget to like share subscribe push that notification bell and make a comment well anyway thank you for watching my video stay safe i'll see you next time so if you want to get the best possible deal, please check out the link below.